Are the new champs out already? Really? They're not fast. Living Battery. Kazari uses her electric powers to charge herself and her weapons for any situation. Full of spark and energy, Zeri electrifies those around. She refuses to get together. When damaging enemy shields, Zeri shields herself for a portion of the damage dealt. Any shield Zeri gains grants her a brief movement speed boost. No slowing down. Zeri volts things up with her Q burst fire. Rather than a traditional base attack, Zeri fires a barrage of seven rounds that damages the first. Did you watch this? Did you watch this? It has an incredibly low cooldown that scales with attack speed and no mana cost. Burst fire will also crit and apply on head effects. For all intents and purposes, her Q is a basic attack skill shot. I mean, I mean let me make this clear. If I see somebody pick this in my game, I'm going to fucking lock in Scion support. Let me make that real clear right now. Because they're not playing to win. And also, why are we why are we still to the point where Because it's day one, obviously. Why are we still to the point where new champs are allowed in ranked, bro? It doesn't make sense. Give them like a, a one week buffer or something. These kids don't know the champion at all. They don't play it. Nobody's gonna play it. I'm, dude, if Q's an auto attack, nobody's gonna know that right off the bat. You lock in this champ in my game, I'm locking in Scion. It's her actual basic attack into an ability, meaning it applies spell effects like Riley's Crystal Scepter, but not attack effects like crits or sheen. This ability can be charged by moving and casting burst fire, dealing massively increased damage and slowing at full charge. It also deals extra damage to low health enemies, making last hitting minions a little easier. But be careful because attacks drain charge, delaying her access to that big ah. chunk of bonus damage. Got the fuel up. Zeri's W is Ultra Shock Laser, an electric pulse that damages and slows the first enemy hit. When the pulse is targeted through terrain, it widens and extends into an ultra, ultra shocking laser. When the pulse is targeted through terrain, it widens and extends into an ultra ultra shocking. When the pulse is targeted through terrain, it widens and extends into an ultra ultra shocking laser that hits multiple enemies. Zeri I wasn't watching. E is spark ultra ultra shock. When the pulse is targeted through terrain, it widens and extends into an ultra ultra shocking laser that hits multiple enemies. Like Jinx and Lux, kind of. Zeri's E is Spark Surge. After dashing a short distance, her next three salvos of burst fire will pierce, damaging enemies beyond the first. Attacks and abilities on enemy champions reduce Spark Surge's cooldown. Zeri can surge across any terrain she touches, no matter how wide. Cooldown. While skating over terrain, cast Ultra Shock Laser for more voltage. Got him. Zeri's ultimate is Lightning Crash, which unleashes an electric nova that damages nearby enemies. Hitting an enemy champion grants overcharge, which gives increased attack speed, bonus on hit damage, and a chain lightning effect on burst fire. Static shift. Overcharge also stacks, providing increased movement speed per stack of overcharge. Attacks and abilities on enemy champions add stacks and extend overcharge's duration to ramp up the movement speed buff further, which lets her kill enemies in a flash, or without it. Got the hurry. People need my spark. What the hurry? People need my spark. While you might yeah, I mean, be don't pick this. to attack, be cautious with excessive auto attacking and draining your charge. Instead, use abilities and kite enemy champions for fully charged slow. Then rail them down without a sweat. Come on, Zeri, fight the wind. Remember that. If you spot your team in trouble, Spark Surge is a great tool to swiftly join the fight. Target some I terrain mean, to skate over, and right before you land, cast Ultra Shock Laser for an electrifying entrance. I mean, I'm confused. Being I'm a literal lie. battery has its positives, especially in rapid fire moments. Lightning crash early in fights, and keep overcharge stacks up with abilities and charged attacks. With all that extra move speed, skating circles around the enemy team is a breeze. Look at them scramble! We dude, I don't think it. she's gonna be. Dude, I feel like. Even if a situation looks dire, Zeri can turn the tides with a multi-target lightning crash. At the moment, I feel like she looks messy. At least I'm consistent. With overcharged but speed, well, you I say that and it's all get shit on the and provide burst fire support from a safer position. Like a familiar shiv, chain damage among enemies and speed your way to victory. Uh. Lightning always strikes twice or 3 to 7 times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, we'll see.